character. Okay. So I had to like create new canvases and new drawing and art pieces and, right. and create this whole sketchbook for them. Okay. Yeah, for my character. So uh -huh. my book was put on hold for a while for that period of time. I see. Until I read and then after that I continued drawing again. Wow. Okay, yeah. but I think the real question here, right, is why? Why a picture book? And why so? Because so is actually sad, correct? A Latin word for yes. sad? Yeah? Mm -hmm. Tayang. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. So why? Um, okay, uh, the backstory, simple backstory. I did art for O levels. Yeah. Yeah, so it was something that I was really into, but right. it kind of like, I, I just kind of put it aside when I had to like, focus on the, the more serious subjects, so to say. I understand. So it was only when I started on the column with I Weekly that I started writing and drawing again. Yeah. So that was when I discovered that I actually do love drawing a lot. Uh -huh. And I still do. So I guess it was kind of like back to basics for me because it's been such a long time since I've last done any sketches or drawing. And, and that was when I was really like experimenting with different mediums like kind of watercolors, acrylics, and even like dabbling with art software and all that. Wow, right. Yeah, so I decided that if I were to come up with a second book, I wanted it to be, yeah, an illustrated piece. Right. Yeah, I, I didn't want it so much focused on me, like, oh, I, I'm writing about myself again. I wanted, yeah. well, the audiences and the readers to actually know me um, as a, a creative person. I understand. Yeah. Right. So I wanted to present something that's very new to them. Right. So this character actually came up from uh, uh, when you were writing the I, I Weekly column. And yes. then after that, you yeah, gave it a name. Yeah. I, I have always been drawing this little girl. Uh, but initially, this girl had like yellow hair and her eyes were different. And only about two, three years back when I decided to come up with a book. Yeah. I decided to give her a makeover. I see. Yeah, I kept her big hair, I changed it, I gave her a name, uh -huh. I gave her a character, a personality, and yeah, I called her Soul because, yeah, I felt that she's full of curiosity, she's always on journeys to look for answers, you know, to a lot of questions that she has in her head. She's still full of hope, so I changed her hair to red. Okay. She's got like big eyes and big lashes. <laughs> Something like you. <laughs> a little bit, I like big eyes and lashes. Yeah, it's a little representation of you. Alright, so that's a very very big question, okay? And and I'm sure a lot of you guys here has questions as well. Alright. Alright, so what we're gonna do now, I'm gonna make it fun. Alright? I'm gonna let two person Alright, just two person, not two person to ask you one question each because you know this is about a girl, you know, searching for answers. So I'm sure there's some people here who are searching for answers about Jeanette as well, okay? So two person, alright? Does anyone have a question for Jeanette? There, over there, okay. I will filter the question now. You don't think you can anyhow ask that you answer, huh? I will filter first. Huh? What do you want? Go ask. Good afternoon, Jeanette. Good afternoon. How do you grow as an actress? with international fame and you still stay humble, friendly. How you know she's humble and friendly? <laughs> <laughs> that's, a, that's a good question. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. She is I, humble and friendly. I, I guess I'm very grounded because of my family and uh, my friends. Uh, my friends don't treat me any different. I'm still the same person and my family don't give me like special treatment as well. <laughs> Yeah, and I guess at the end of the day, I'm just, I'm, I'm happy the way I am. And yeah, I, I think I, yeah, it's, it's a conscious decision. It's a conscious effort to not get swayed by whatever comes my way. Uh, and I think that's also why I make a very fine line between personal and work related issues. I don't share my personal life in public and all that. So I make that very clear because I just want to protect like what I am and yeah and draw a very clear line yeah. there I could ask more but I'll respect that line <laughs> 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 alright you over here uh, uh, what's your name? Rachel 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 what do you want to ask Jeanette? I hope that the next book won't take so long. <laughs> yeah, because this... Thank you so much. I'm actually hoping to come up with a series of Soul's World. 
Yeah, so okay. hopefully my next okay. illustrated book won't take that long. Have you started? I've started, <gasps> yes. I really look forward to for your new book. Yeah. Thank you, thank you so much. Wow, you started already, uh. yeah, yeah. Is it like you know left over from this one? <laughs> no, no. Because when I when I when I when I uh, planned for this book, I actually did plan for a series. Right, I see. Yeah, which okay. Is, which is also why I named it Soul's World. Soul's World. So that it's like a series, and then she's always on different journeys. Wow. Yeah. So I did plan in advance. Wow. <laughs> I love that future planning. I love it. Okay. So okay, before we move on to the actual oh, I I very Jiza, sorry, I thought a lot. I'm sorry, I'm very sorry. I'm like delaying everyone's uh, uh, uh signing time. But today you will make sure you sign all the books. Yes. Everyone that's here today, right? Correct? So but before I move on, right, I want to say talk about these people over here, okay? Yes, I know. They're like they Geniuses. especially and yeah. The, the group of people here, my fan club, uh, who are always there for me. Right. And also there's a group of them here who specially flew in from Cambodia. <laughs> Them to actually 